Hello guys, welcome back to another episode with Morris's Paranormal Adventures. Today I brought you to uh, an abandoned location called Hunter's Lodge. There's people on here, we're not sure, so we're just going to quickly find. Somebody's been ripping stuff out here. It's all right, yeah. Nobody there yet. Mad, isn't it? <laughs> Come on. Don't leave this, man. I swear to you then. I swear to you then, John, I heard somebody in here. And I ain't bullshitting, mate, that's only like... But there is people next door working, I think.
Good shells. Yeah, I'll go this way. Upstairs here. There's another place here we can go upstairs. Yeah. Some stairs back there as well, do not Yeah, they walk this way though because they can see you in the house there. Yeah. Don't do that, that's too far, that's fucked there. through to that room. Sounds like it's hungry that, doesn't it? Can you give it that? No. Hang on, give me a far love. Just a night love, I've just come for a night. Just drop it like I have. Fucking night, it makes a shit at all. <laughs> Don't forget to leave us a nice comment on the yeah. reviews. Good comment, good reviews, we've got a microwave. This floor, man. But it was smart as fuck back in there. Though. Well, you knew the difference. Thirty quid. I wouldn't even pay that. So we're gonna look at the other building. We're gonna look at the other building. That Yeah, but try not let that people see you.
Dat vind ik niet. Ja. Dat, dat komt daar niet zo eens. Dat is gewoon een beetje. Bathroom zitten. Dat zou eens willen, toch? Ah ja, als men in het. Sluit met zo'n veld. Nou, zoek je. Nou, ik kies al wel. Dat is bij Blue Run, is het? Alright guys, it was just a quick one, but I've got plenty more today, so keep your eyes uh, keep your eyes open, I'm just going to take some pictures now, and I'll be back on. Hello everyone, welcome back to Morris's Paranormal Adventures, where I'm doing another episode, but today I'm joined by Moxley's Paranormal World. We actually came out to investigate the sightings of the Bewley Hall Park, Bigfoot, in Salford. So we're actually, um, we're actually here to do that, actually here to get a little bit of evidence. As we're walking around this, this area, we stumbled up on an abandoned building. So we thought we'll check it out. We've just had a look on the internet. This dates back to World War I and II. Um, in 1902 is when Bewley Hall Park bought it. The council bought it, so... Um, it's very creepy. I don't know what it's been since. We literally snuck in. We shouldn't, we shouldn't, we shouldn't, but we do. That's what we do. The door was open anyway. But um, I mean, we're Moxie's Paranormal World, so I'm just gonna show you a quick round, have a quick look round before we um, before we do anything else, because we're actually here for Bigfoot sightings. Um, you have a quick walk round, here's the room. So yeah, we just um, we were just walking around and then stumbled up on this building. So we have to have a look. We've literally been here for about ten minutes, and uh, that door then. No, it was the door. It was the door. Just goes whoop as it was closing last minute. Some of them catches. Oh, nice. Just he got me as well. That's why I tried to show it quietly. <laughs> Mate, listen. We've been. I was just saying then. We've been in literally ten minutes, and we could already hear footsteps. Yes. And that shadow that went past that door. I forgot about that. You saw it. I've seen it before you, and you was taking a picture. I thought your flash was on, but it won't, was it? No. Wow, look at that. Wow, that's a big cookie station. Man, look at the size of that. So what we did find out on the internet is that it does date back to World War One and Two. You can tell the buildings outside. I'll show you the buildings outside. Um, but it's definitely, it's definitely an old building. Very creepy. We um, I'm just saying to Moxley then we could hear footsteps. Canteen.
So yeah, guys, as mentioned, we were out doing, um, looking for the one over the sightings of the Bigfoot. Wanted to see what we could find, any evidence we could find, as there's been a recent um, finding, of, uh, a recent sighting of Bigfoot four years ago. And there's been sightings since 1960s, uh, 1970s, 1980s, 2000s. So we decided to come and have a look, but then we stumbled up on this building. So, it's different, but I, I have to show you. You know what I mean? Moxley! Hey. Moxley! <laughs> I didn't even know he could get in that room. <laughs> it's such an I didn't even know you could get in that room from there. I'm trying to open the door, mate. <laughs> it's like the only door that's locked. Are you feeling the weird presence around there, though? The weird feeling. The down, atmosphere is different, isn't it? Down this bottom end, it is. Yeah. Down, down this bottom end feels different, yeah, for sure. That's it. Yeah, you experience it through the day, then it's better than the night then. Yeah. It helps us though to see if they're safe, you don't want to be falling through floors. That's it, these floors seem pretty sturdy to be fair. Yeah, they're good these. Right. You can't be fall out now. When I said they've been dated back to the wall, obviously. They've been updated since that. There's plasterboard and there's wood on roofs, but the brickwork outside and stuff like that, that's on the other back bit. It, it's really, really old. Um, so you can tell it dates back quite a long time. Good, 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 hundred, good, good few hundred years, I think it dates back to this. More. It marks it just had a leak online and it dates back to a good few hundred years. Walking down at the bottom down there does feel like different different than than at the top because when we were stood at the top me and Moxley we could we could see a shadow just went past the door so it was like what was that oh, I saw it first and then Moxley went do you see that shadow then so we saw it as well but then we were stood in the hall this hallway and we could hear it we could hear footsteps down here but as like as we as we mentioned we're here today for Bigfoot. We're going to look at the uh, Salford Bigfoot sightings, see if we can get any evidence. Um, they said it was a dog man or it could have been a Bigfoot but it was definitely a hurry, hurry creature over seven foot tall. Um, it looked like a big muscular man with square teeth, um, big muscles, big muscles on its jaw, um, pure naked but with hair all over its body. The, these, these sightings, there's, there's maybe six or seven sightings in this area of the Dogman or the Bigfoot. <laughs> We're going underground. <laughs> this is mad.
that many things to come, mate. Just going up to look at it. That's it a little bit, man, honestly. Can't believe we're going underground. I know. <laughs> right. I'm not even too sure what this part was for. Well, I know it's a big part of the Manchester network and all to the intercom. <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> right. Is there anything else there? Eh? No, I just had a loop then. Oh, that bit. Right. Looks like we're going down. Let's go. Let's go in. 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 So this is a tunnel guys, but it doesn't lead underground this one. I just came down for a show you. It's okay. Oh. Right. I know. Right guys, I think we actually have found Oh shit, dripping my head. We've actually actually found another room. Yeah, you've got to go up there, and then it, I don't know where it leads. It leads into a bigger room, though, I'm sure. Be careful that it all collapse. You can see yeah. footsteps here? Yeah, I can see the footsteps there. Yeah, so they've been here. Yeah. yeah, leave my bag there for one sec, I'll go and check it. Yeah, go and check it out. Guys, who knows? Who knows what's been in here? Who's been here over the years? Could be families living in here. That is old. That is really old. That is really old. Back on in a sec, guys. We could take some pictures. Big old radiator. The pipe is in the back, isn't it? It's knocked off though. Because a lot of them have been bricked up, so these clearly led somewhere, didn't they? Yeah. Or do lead somewhere. 